So one of the tough questions I think that, that people have is when they first sign up for a Mastodon instance and then they realize, oh, I didn't want to be here. Or, ooh, the grass is greener over there. <laughs> then they want to move. Uh, so I thought it would be fun to sort of model this and I'm hoping I'm able to do it um, here and this I don't crash and burn. It's actually been less than 30 days since I migrated, so I may be violating some rule, um, but we'll see. So I'm going to come down here and uh, go to my preferences, and uh, the first step I want to do in my new instance, the new place I'm moving to, is to go in and establish myself. So I feel pretty confident that I've done that uh, with Kodo. Um, if you've watched the first three parts of this video series, you know that I've set myself up here at Kodo. I've had it sort of customized. I've imported a lot of my followers um, and uh, a lot more. So now what I want to do is actually um, go to my account settings and I'm going to come down here and what I want to do is say I want to I'm moving from a different account so the first thing I need to do is create an account alias now I've already created the account alias but this is where I type in my old account uh, which is mgulin at hcommons.social and then I click on create Ali alias and that will sort of link this information down here at the bottom uh, so that way uh, it's going to make it easier for people to find me. Just for fun, I'm going to type in another one that I had from before. Uh, and again, this is, well, let's see, we'll see. Oops, that one's not taking. So, but the idea here is basically that you're going to type in your old account name and, and then uh, link it. So now I have uh, two of the places I've been. I'm, I'm also going to ha add the no big tech and uh, so these are the different Mastodon instances that I've had the opportunity to be a part of over the last uh, year and I just want to link them here and, and again like it says right here this action is harmless and reversible if I wanted to I can come back and unlink them uh, but the account migration is initiated from the old account so to do that I'm now ready to go over to um, my H Commons account and just come over here to account um, it says my accounts fully um, you know whatever and I'm ready to come down here where it says move to a different account so I'm going to say configure it here and it says this account will move all followers from the current account to the new account well I've sort of already done that because I imported a whole bunch of people no other data will be moved automatically so it's important that you come over and you actually download or export all of any data that you want to keep um, so the question is have I done that well I don't, I'm not sure I'm pretty sure I got this one the follows but I want to make sure I get my lists and it's gonna ask me where do I want to save that so I'm just gonna save that right there on my desktop um, I can't save my followers, but uh, hopefully they'll follow me back on the new in the new place. And then anyone that I'm happen to be blocking, I want to make sure to save that. Uh, anyone that I've muted, as you can see, I haven't had to mute too many people. Um, and then any bookmarks. For me, that's the most important piece. I have 52 bookmarks. I would not want to lose those. Okay, I've now sort of backed up or exported my critical data here. Um, I have downloaded my archive before but it's not been very useful to me. I can't read it and it's um, it's just some basic it's information but it's not in a format that's readable to me. Um, I asked some smart people that I know uh, how do you view that uh, archive and they didn't know either so uh, I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm just gonna say okay I'm gonna lose all those posts that I've sent out they're gone. But that's okay. I mean, uh, if you're living in the moment and, and making connections and having conversations with people, it's not that big of a deal. Okay, so I'm going to move to a different account. I'm going to configure it here. We were just here a moment ago. And it says, what's the handle of the new account? Well, I'm going to type in uh, mgulin at kodo.org. I'm going to type in 
my top secret password and I'm going to click on move followers and it says I've, I've got an a, uh, error it says that's not working so specify the username and domain I think it's probably because I put a did I put an at sign in the front of it let's try it now one more time nope it says it's still not there so we'll put an at symbol in front of that and type in oh I th let me go ahead and click on move followers it's still not quite taking it let me try putting and this is something I wish they would they would sort of put an example here I know it username and domain of the account you want to move to so this account that I'm moving to is um, mgulin at kodo.org so why am I encountering a problem uh, it's still not letting me I'm gonna try putting in my email account and see how that works yeah it still didn't didn't like it so and it's not taking it so um, there may be a waiting period and that's what I'm encountering is that error as I mentioned before it doesn't allow that so I would suspect that I've typed in the information correctly but because of the waiting period it's not going to allow me to to finish that up um, so since I can't do that I'm just gonna put up a redirect and hopefully that will uh, work and uh, later on I should be able to do that so now it says my account is redirecting to mgulin at kodo.org so hopefully what's happening is as people uh, try to connect to me at HCommon Social, uh, they they won't be able to do that. It's usually important to sort of leave a goodbye message, and I hope I can, and it says my login's currently disabled. So I should have I should have clicked post before I I hit that, but uh, I'll uh, actually um, just post that from my Kodo account, and I should be okay because remember they can access it from anywhere so I'll just have to adjust this message say as much as I've enjoyed I'm heading over I blame somebody well let me just take that out because I don't want I don't want anybody to be confused to, even though that person's wonderful and we don't want to confuse them and then uh, it says so please be aware that I'm in the process of moving I'll hope to see you there okay I'm gonna go ahead and click toot and now that message is out there and uh, anybody who is following me uh, will see that message out there so now I've essentially made the move over since I'm I really sort of brought my own users over uh, let me go ahead and just quickly add uh, or import uh, some of the other things that I think are important um, I'm gonna import my blocking list blocked accounts I'm going to import my muting list. Muted accounts. And finally, I'm going to go ahead and. Uh, oh, bookmarks is not here. So I'm not able to import my bookmarks. That's a bummer, isn't it? Uh, so I guess I'm sort of stuck with that. I'll have to go look at my bookmarks file and see is that something that I can work with. So let me go ahead and uh, open up my text editor. This is going will be fun. And let me go open up that um, those bookmarks. Hopefully I'll be able to do something with it. 
So there's all my bookmarks. Um, so I haven't actually lost them. If I want to, I can just uh, click those and they should be able to pop right up uh, or, or be accessible. So let me go back to Mastodon, paste in my bookmarks. And at this point, you have to decide whether it's worth worth keeping or not. Uh, so this one was posted by somebody at Journia, Journa Host uh, at A. Hyatt. And so I'd have to be able to see whether that's actually even going to come up on my screen. Some of the, the little problems with that. So I guess I would probably want to look at my bookmarks um, before... I make the transition and clean them out or figure out a way of what's the important information there. So I'm not too worried. I did make another backup of my bookmarks in a different way. I use uh, Digo to back up all my stuff so I haven't lost any information but uh, just something to illustrate for you. Okay well that's pretty much it. Uh, I'm now here at Kodo and this is my new home. Uh, now I need to go update all my million business cards and uh, uh, do that. So thank you all.